the porch or hit the if it happened to it makes a round sounds on my lap putting rap on my back and I'm black and snatching crowns I they came back around like a I got a bag now with the bloodhounds making love sounds to a bad chick she from uptown or from down south not a loud mouth we could around hit the down when I shine bright blind up now in the cut big black truck you can pick it up now okay push the off of the porch or get the if it happens if it makes a round sounds on my lap push it back and go to town down putting rap on my back and I'm black and snatching crowns They attached emotionally. I get the clutch, and if you get too close to me, I'm at the top where I'm supposed to be. Jumping in the game like they coaching me. Falling the rats ain't with a shoulder me. I'm on the road and. Hi everyone, we're coming to you live on 2K Sports, bringing you the NBA. I'm Kevin Harlan, with me tonight, former NBA players Richard Jefferson and Greg Anthony, with David Aldridge joining us courtside. Hey Dave. Thanks very much. Now Commissioner Adam Silver is continuing to push for the creation of an in-season tournament. He says the notion is to steal a page from European soccer. It's not the Larry O'Brien trophy, but something secondary that teams care about. Something you'd see players go into that extra gear for. Kevin, back to you. That's pretty intriguing, DA. It's an interesting story, and we thank you for giving it to us. Well, we expect to see sparks flying down in the paint tonight. Greg, a couple of very talented centers matching up head-to-head -head in this one. And But with the way the game is played today, you know, we could see them battling at the arc. Modern bigs make their presence felt now all over the floor. A look at Atlanta's opening lineup. Murray is the shooting guard, Hunter the small forward. Collins and Capella man the post position. And it's Young go. in at the point. And for Philadelphia, on the block, it's Tucker next to Embiid. Harden out there with Tyrese Maxey. And it's Harris in at the three, the small forward. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And man, has DeJounte Murray blossomed Richard into a very special player or what? He's been terrific. And this has happened because he's embraced having more responsibility. The minute you accept being a leader, the future becomes bright. The first one falls. And a big trade this last summer was Murray coming to the Hawks. Paid a hefty price, but Atlanta feels he and Trey make a great backcourt pair. Hard to think of a more deadly backcourt in the East. And he makes the first, but misses the second. AGA, what about these Hawks? They can really be fun to watch. Yeah, and they just need to be more consistent, Kevin. It seems they can beat anyone on any day. If they can start doing that regularly, we're talking about big things in the future. Now, here's Hunter. Hawks passing it around. The kick out to Young. That's in there. Murray with the assist. Murray is capable of getting double-digit assists anytime he's on the floor because he is an unselfish point guard. And B with a screen on Young. Here's Harden. It's hauled in by Clint Capella. Defense pulled out all the stops to shut him down there. Young with the ball. Capella finds Young. Collins a screen on Hart. Down low. Down to five on the shot clock. And the basket is good. 
with soft hands and, and great recognition. Collins is the ideal big for a pick and roll. Embiid with a screen on Murray. Shoots from eight, and Capella sends it back. Pass to Murray. Young in the corner. 11 feet away. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That one on Harris. So clever at creating contact. Young looks to shoot it so often, which really forces defenders to overcommit at times. And the way Trey Young GA is the focus of this offense, the numbers j just pile up. Yeah, I mean, they run so much through him. His usage rate is off the charts. Led the entire league in total points and total assists in 2022. And that hadn't been done in 49 years. Probably as close to a sure thing as you can have at the free throw line. Embiid against Young. Embiid inside. And the dunk by Embiid. Now I understand he's a large human, but the defense has to be better. You can't let Embiid get whatever he wants inside. Now, here is Young. He has five to the paint. Wants to get it to Collins and does. My goodness. Say, say that one. I, I want to see that again. Me too. Just absolutely beautiful. Harden against Young. And yes, it's good. Figuring out ways to score. That is James Harden's specialty. The beard can hurt you inside and out. And that was the mobile one drive. Well worth a second look. And the awareness of his footwork and body on that drive. Wow. Now, here is Young. Collins kicks to Murray. And here's Young from the arc. And they get it back. Collins passes to Young. Driving inside. The shot, no good. Good work defensively by Harden. And so it's Harden bringing it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. Six-point game. A nice shot by Embiid. The footwork, the patience, watching Embiid go to work inside is just a treat. Capella with a screen on Harden. Harden against Young. Over Harden. And too long on the shot. 76ers have gone 50% from the field, hitting three of six since the opening tip. And no good. But close in that one, so he'll shoot two. That's his first personal It's his first trip to the line. First team foul. At the line for Philadelphia, Tyrese Maxey. At the line for two. And he can't get the first one and some added toughness on the roster. Something Philly knew they needed after last year's playoffs. The hope is adding scrappy veterans like P.J. Tucker and DeAnthony Melton will help them further this go-round. Now, here is Young. Five points in the game. Here's Murray. Here's Collins. And then Collins slams it in. One of the most explosive young bigs we have. Collins quick off the floor and gets creative at the rim. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. And Bede with a screen on Young. Here's Harden. Another miss by Philadelphia. Oh, I can see some miscommunication on defense there very clearly. They were super fortunate it didn't torch them with that mistake. The 76ers trail by five. And here's MB. Over Murray. Embiid, no good. For Atlanta, they've gone 50% from the field to this point. Four of eight. Here's Hunter. And Embiid with the block. Love to see Embiid sliding down shots, taking advantage of his size and frame. Puts it up, off the inbound. That one off the back iron and out. And the 76ers with possession, trailing by five. Harden with it, and Young picks him up defensively. And it goes down two points. 
Embiid's got six. Just another thing that makes Embiid unguardable. He can hit shots from any spot on the floor. Young from outside. That one, no good. Now the 76ers take it the other way. Here's Maxi. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Yeah, and there it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great inside position. Young dishes to Capella. Young against Harden. Outside Cohen. From outside the arc. And MB pulls it down. The 76ers have gotten five of ten shots to drop in this game so far. Right at the 50% mark. Here's Tucker. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Don't you forget, Harden won the assist title now. This man can pass that rock. And Atlanta calls their first time out of the game. Sixers will go for a different look here. On Trez Harrell, he's checked in for Embiid. George Niang comes in for P.J. Tucker. The Anthony Milton, he's checked in for Maxi, And it's Shake Milton in for James Harden. And Atlanta will go for a different look here. Kaminsky, he's checked in for Clint Capella. Okongwu comes in for John Collins. Bogdan Bogdanovich, he's checked in for Hunter. And Justin Holliday subbed in for Young. Murray, no good. The defense just giving him the easy look there. He's not going to miss that. Here's Melton. To the middle. And it's Harrell missing. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on it. Murray kicks to Bogdanovich. The dish to Kaminsky. Fader on the way. That shot missing. Now the 76ers take it the other way. Now Melton. And it's sent back by Okongwu. So it's Bogdanovich who brings up the ball for the Hawks. Trailing by two. Here's Holiday. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. In a moment here, take a look at the scoring breakdown for Philadelphia. At the line for the Hawks, Justin Holliday. At the line for two. He misses the free throw. He hits the second from the line. Now the 76ers with it. They're on a 14 to 5 run. Milton kicks to Niang. The 76ers again can't hit it. Land has gone a meager 1 of 6 from three point land since we got started tonight. Holiday, the pass to Murray. Now here is Holiday. D right on him. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Now look, he is a solid distributor. Murray is gifted at finding his teammates pretty much in any spot on the floor. Milton the pass to Harrell. 54 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Count it, good. And the 76ers lead by one. And improving as a shot maker every year. Harold has to be accounted for defensively. He muscles it in through the contact, and they call the foul. He's on his way to the free throw line. And that's what the pump fakes there for. Get your man off his feet and drive right around him. The Hawks shooting their seventh attempt at the foul line in this one. The 76ers making a switch here. Korkmaz is checked in. Harkless is checked in for the Hawks. One misses for Murray. 
and certain teams take on the attitude of their city. And over the years, Philadelphia has been one of them. The Sixers known for having tough teams, much like the Tampa. Now here's Harkless. He's guarded by Melton. Murray lays it up off the glass. Hey, Murray. Murray's got five. He has no problem going in there with the big trees because Murray is focused on that possession. There's 18 seconds left in the first quarter. Here's Melton. Murray with the defensive effort. Over Milton. One second left. The Hawks have missed a few free throws up to this point, shooting 4 of 7 from the foul line tonight. And that one misses. Taking two shots. He's good on the second. And that does it for the first quarter. Hawks on top, up by four. Live from Philadelphia, you're watching 2K Sports. We've played through one quarter in this one. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Hawks. The 76ers trail by four. On the block, it's Tucker next to Embiid. Korkmaz is out there with Harden. And it's Harris in at the small forward position. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. A master at working through contact. Sometimes it seems Harden prefers getting physical on the way up. Young against Harden. Floats one up. It's hauled in by the 76ers. And Beat's got five rebounds tonight. And the short break in the action gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thanks very much. Now, some people call John Collins John the Baptist for how he dunks over defenders. He says, the game is slowing down for me. I'm able to see my spots. I want to continue to build on that and be looked at as a pillar, a guy that can be counted upon. Training. Kevin, it seems he's hungry for more. Back to you. He's a big time dunker, that's for sure, looking to reach his full potential. David, thanks. And here's Harden, following the three-pointer by Trey Young. And Harden with the stuff. Just an absolute master at creating separation. That is a nice move by Harden to free himself up. The Hawks leading by three. Young inside, guarded by Harden. Young, good. Young's got five points now this quarter. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. And one thing, Greg, we know Capella has always done. He plays to his strengths. It's a great point, Kevin. Capella knows where he's best and, and really focuses on that. Can help the team with minimal touches on offense, but he really anchors a defense by not overextending. Look, some of James Harden's career numbers are crazy, but he's also got a lot of firsts to go along with those overall totals, like the first 60-point triple-double. And Harden was the first player to average 35 points and seven assists in a season. Yeah, and that was in the 2018-19 season. The same year, he was also the first player to score at least 30 points against every other team. No one had done that since the NBA expanded in 2004. And the NBA in recent years has gone from measuring players' height in shoes to now, Richard, just in socks. Like for instance, Draymond Green went from 6'7", to 6'6", six, six. although he'll probably argue that with you. Uh, did you get shorter without shoes? I was one of the rare players that actually rounded lower. I was 6'6 six, six and 3 fourths without shoes on, so I would probably be closer to 6'9 with shoes and socks and orthotics. So, you know, look, I was one of the honest ones, so I have no issue with them bringing it back down. So it's fine. 
I'm glad they're changing it up and we're getting accurate numbers. So it's the Hawks in Philadelphia able to drain the three. Harden up top, defended by Young. Harden scanning the floor. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's going to be on Trey Young. You got to be careful when guarding Harden. He's so crafty at finding ways to draw fouls. Well, James Harden still a tremendous player, but now in his early 30s, some question, can he be the dominant MVP force we saw in Houston? Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. throw good James Harden and Greg Harden in recent years dealing with hamstring injuries has he lost a step to age or injury you know probably a little of both but we've seen players with a new diet or training regimen get back to peak production hopefully he can as well that one is no good and at this stage in Harden's career he's all about winning he wants to win as many titles as he can Stolen by Tucker. Harden with it. And Young picks him up defensively. Another miss by Philadelphia. And so Young will bring it up for Atlanta. The pass to Hunter. Capella sends a screen for Hunter. It's hauled in by the 76ers. And Beach got six rebounds in the game. Maxi kicks to Harris. And no good had a chance to take the lead there. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. And the rejection by Embiid. Harris against Hunter. Harris's shot is good. And the 76ers lead by one. And look, Harris is a tough player. With a little defense, that's not going to scare him off of going inside. Young finds Hunter. After two misses to start the game, he's on the board with that shot made. Guys, no one team gaining control early on. Yeah, and you look at the lead changes. Six already. Harden has a wide open look. Connects from three-point range. Harden's got the lead up to two now for the 76ers. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. Matisse Thibel checked in for James Harden. On defense, Philadelphia. Now, here is Young. 12 points for him. No good that time. Gotta find easier shots when you're already struggling. That's not gonna get it. Here's Maxi. And the rejection by Collins. And that shows you a bit of Collins' all-around game and why he's so valuable at both ends of the floor. Murray's checked in for Young. Capella finds Holiday. And here is Murray. Takes the 13 footer. It's hauled in by Harris. The 76ers lead. Maxi against Holiday. 
And the rejection by Collins. Here we go with Holiday running it up the court. And there's Collins on the assist by Holiday. Collins has got it all tied up now for the Hawks. Philadelphia has gone three of six tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. Embiid against Capella. Embiid inside. That's tipped. Maxi with it. Guarded by Hunter. And what a play. Just snatched out of the air. Credit the block. And it's DeAndre Hunter with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. Ryan Kaminsky, he's checked in for the Hawks. Okongwu comes in for Collins. Embiid with a screen on Murray. Maxi, the 76ers again, can't hit it. Atlanta's gone one or two on three-pointers here in the second quarter so far. Picked him clean. Drives to the hoop and stolen by Murray. Inside, and the basket by Kaminsky. Just a textbook lead pass right there, putting it right where it needed to be. Murray against Maxi. And it's sent back by Okongwu. Pass to Murray. Okongwu with the screen from her. And stolen by Thibel. In the corner, it's Harris. Poked away. 119 left to play here in the second quarter. Six to shoot. Off target from three-point range. And Murray's got the ball here for Atlanta. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Tyrese Maxey. That is his first foul of the game. And the 76ers will go for a different look here. On Trez Harrell, he's checked in for Joel Embiid. George Niang comes in for P.J. Tucker. DeAnthony Melton, he's checked in for Harris. And it's Jake Milton in for Maxi. Maurice Harkless is checked in for Atlanta. Bogdan Bogdanovich comes in for Justin Holiday. Harkless finds Bogdanovich to the inside. Kaminsky and finished off by Kaminsky. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. And you can feel the jolt of energy that he sent through his team. That is a huge boost in a tight game like this. And Philadelphia has possession after the basket by Atlanta. And when you think of Harold, his endless energy is what comes to mind first. This guy just hustles and works every moment he's out there. Philadelphia shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. And one of the highlights last year for this group was the fact that they were so efficient from the charity strike. That's a huge factor. Mark Miles, he's jacked in for Matisse Thibel. We'll see if they want to trade two for one here. Got to time up that clock to do so. Passes it to Okongwu. Here's Bogdanovich. Again, the Hawks, good for two. And that's cash. Bogdanovich is a legitimate threat to burn you from that mid-range. Harrell a screen on Bogdanovich. Loads it up there for Harrell. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. Right side, Bogdanovich. Pass to Okongwu. Now here's Kaminsky. He's guarded by Melton. The jump hook. He doesn't hit that one. It is a shame to see a high percentage look go to waste. You'll be hearing about this one in the locker room, I'm sure. 32. Uh -huh. 37. All right, Dave, thank you. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports.
And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. Without question, Trey Young displaying his skills today. And how about the amount he's contributing in the scoring column through two quarters? He has been terrific. He always wants to be a go-to guy for them. I'm sure he'll be calling for the ball even more in this half. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. And on the floor for Nate McMillan starting the second half. Collins and Capella man the post position. Murray is the shooting guard. Hunter the small forward. And it's Young in at the point guard position. Now here is Young. After the miss from Tyrese Maxey. Collins up top. Guarded by Harris. Six on the shot clock. Capella sets a screen for Murray. Plenty of daylight on that shot. Murray's got the lead up to eight now for the Hawks. Outstanding work in the pick and roll. Murray is just keeping things simple in these sets. And Harden with the stuff. That should give him a nice little jolt. Uh, yeah, it has to. They need a jolt, GA. And they need more where that came from. They're not out of this hole yet. Now, here is Young. He's got 12. Second half just getting started. About a minute played. Philadelphia shooting a meager 37% for the game. Well, Greg, what can you say about Joel Embiid's growth from a leadership perspective? Pretty impressive, isn't it? Tremendous, Kevin. Carrying the Sixers with everything they went through, even though he came in second in MVP voting two years in a row, no player more important to his team than Joel Embiid. And stolen by Harris. The Trey. Maxi, no good. The Hawks. Leading by six. Young dishes to Collins. Murray the pass to Hunter. Murray against Maxi. Just five on the clock. Lobbed up there for Collins. Trying to go for an alley-oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop it. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. And Embiid throws it down. I like whenever Embiid's teammates use his size and throw it anywhere near the rim because he finishes it. Time called here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. It's gone in this third quarter now. Young against Harden. 13 feet away. And he hits the jump shot. Young's got 14 points for the game. He's smart at using the screen there to just create space. Young, very reliable in that pick and roll. Here's Harden. Here's Tucker. No good from outside. And he might have thrown himself off when he saw how much space he had from three. Hunter kicks to Capella. Young with no one around. Again, the Hawks good for two. Yeah, when Trey gets in a rhythm like this, he can bury you with shots. The defense needs to try something new. Now it's Harden. 14 points for him. No one near Maxi as he lets it fly. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got six assists now in the game. And here's Young. He'll bring it up for the Hawks. Six-point lead. He kicks it to Hunter. Collins, a screen on Harris. Hunter, no good. 76ers have gone three of six in the third quarter. 50% from the field. Harris outside. That three off the mark. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Young passes to Capella. Murray looking around. He dishes it to Hunter. To the left side wing. With his first shot attempt, that one wide left. The 76ers trail by six. Harris passes to Embiid. 
Hey, Richard, as soon as your playing career ended, you got right into this business, into broadcasting. When did you decide that this would be the next step? Uh, well, the first time is when I thought I was going to be out the league, and so I started uh, doing more and more work uh, until I retired in 2018. So it started way before uh, I retired. That laid the groundwork for you. Good job. Now, Maxi after the miss three from Trey Young. It's good, and the Hawks lead has got down to two on the bucket from Embiid. It's near impossible trying to guard Embiid in the pick and roll. He's just so clever. Oh, what an impressive dribble drive. That replay brought to you by Mobile One. And a close game like this, you've got to dig deep and just find a way to make things happen. The 76ers have gone 5-9 of nine on field goal attempts since halftime. Harden for the tie. Maxi, no good. Atlanta's gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Marie finds Young. Back to Murray. Dishes it to Collins. Capella, the pass to Murray. Hawks passing it around. Capella bounce pass. From deep, Collins. That's in. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here. Changes for Philadelphia. Harrell, he's checked in for Embiid. Matisse Thibel comes in for P.J. Tucker. And it's DeAnthony Melton in for Maxi. And Atlanta will go for a different look here. Kaminsky, he's checked in for Capella. Okongwu comes in for John Collins. Bogdanovich, he's checked in for Hunter. And Justin Holliday subbed in for Murray. The 76ers trail by five. Carroll was screen on Young. Harden inside the three-point line. He trains the quick shot. Harden's got four this quarter. It's crazy. We've gotten used to this effortless dominance from James Harden. He scores in a multitude of ways. Here's Young. Rebound by the 76ers. Here's Harden on the wing. Defended by Young. And it's sent back by Okongwu. Young inside, defended by Thibel, and that one good. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Hawks. Harris a screen on Young. There's the three. It will go down, and the Hawks' lead is cut down now to just two on the basket from Harden. Big three-point shot from James Harden. Look, this man locks in, and that is his shot. Stolen away. And now the 76ers on the break. Throws down the breakaway jam. That's a stomach punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. That's the last thing you need to happen down the stretch. Let's see how they respond to the devastating punch. Such an instinctual player. Young often sees the opportunity before anyone else. Harrell a screen on Young. Harden again, Philadelphia. Hit works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now, here is Young. 18 points for him. Pat Donovich wide open. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Bogdanovich has got five points so far. It's Harden with the drive. And Harden with the stop. Okay, I see the explosion. Harden never ceases to amaze me. Here's the pass to Kaminsky. Here's Bogdanovich. Sweet little floater. And it's seven points for Bogdan Bogdanovich. The floater is so tough to defend against. Nothing defenders can really do but shake their heads. Here's Harden. 
No good that time. So the Hawks will take it the other way. Young finds Holiday. Back to Young. Astro Kongwu. Seven foot shot in Atlanta again with the bucket. Nine seconds left in the third quarter. Here is a screen on Young. First team foul. Substitution on the court. They set the screen. And so it's the Atlanta Hawks with their lead standing at six points here at the end of the quarter. A good size advantage, and they'll look to increase it. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. And how about the floor generalship right here? I mean, showing us why they're always in good hands when he's the man in charge. He does do a great job steering the ship for them out there and keeping the offense clicking. And with three quarters behind us, we start the fourth quarter in what is still anybody's ballgame. Harden out there with the Anthony Melton. Then there's Embiid, and it's Niang in at the four-man position. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Harkless finds Collins, takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. And let the big man eat. It's clear that Collins loves getting these kinds of scoring opportunities. High post, Embiid. Capella's there. Embiid, no good. The Hawks leading by eight. Right side, Bogdanovich. Harden against Murray. Collins wide open. He fires. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by MB. Maxi's checked in for the 76 DeAndre Hunter, he's checked in for the Hawks. Here's Capella. Come to me, come to me. Hunter with it. Five on the clock. The Hawks need to get off a shot here. And the shot goes down. Bogdanovich has got the lead up to 10 now for Atlanta. Showing off his inside game. Bogdan is an all-around score. Here's Harden. Kicks it to Embiid. And stolen by Bogdanovich. We've gone about a minute and a half into the fourth quarter. Corner shot. And again, it's Atlanta. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're reeling, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. Here's MD. After the basket by Bogdan Bogdanovich. Shoots over Capella, and Capella sends it back. Opponents have to be careful when Capella is in the area. What an impressive display of timing. Hey, yo, right here. Bogdanovich dishes to Murray. That ball. Nice speed that time from Bogdanovich. And the Hawks lead by 15. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. Timeout called the 76ers. And now, let's take a look at the new balance player of the game, John Collins. And his focus, guys, has been laser sharp, and his touch from the field, flawless. 
the teammates have worked hard to get him the ball in some good positions. And boy, has he rewarded them with a spectacular shooting performance. Great call to keep running all those sets for him. Teams need contributions from everybody to win on the road, not just the stars. And he's done more than his share tonight. An outstanding performance. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Hey, Kevin, during the last break, I heard Doc Rivers talking with his team. To be honest, he was fired up. He asked his team, how badly do you want this? Because those guys over there, they're going to give it everything they've got, which means we have to do the same. See if they can match them, emotion for emotion. Kevin? Thank you, David. Athletic move by Harden. Okay, I see you throwing it down on top of the defense. And so it's Murray with it. He brings it up for the Atlanta Hawks. Young against Embiid. Takes the 13-footer. They recover it. Shot clock at six. Launches it. Oh, and he almost had a four. Point play right there. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. Uh, the quickness, the change of pace with the dribble. Young, so difficult to stop without fouling. And he sinks the second. And he nails the third. The 76ers trail by 16. And the jam by Harden. That should give him a nice little jolt. Uh, yeah, it has to. They need a jolt here. And they need more where that came from. They're not out of this hole yet. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. I think Murray knows exactly what he's doing. He's going to go to that defender knowing he's going to get contact. And Philadelphia making a change here. Harris has checked in. That one misses, so he goes one for two. And if you need a lockdown defender, Richard, look no further than Matisse Thibel. Yeah, I watched him play in college at Washington. And in a short amount of time, this guy has proven that he can take on anyone. Exceptional at blocking shots at his position, but he's someone that you can throw on any team's best player, and I mean any team. Young, no good. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. There's a little burst to Hardy's game. You can see that on the breaks. The Hawks leading by 11. And here's Young. Good work there as it goes. Young's got 23. And when the score is as lopsided as it is, and you can see they smell blood in the water, Hot Man is going for the jump. Taking matters into his own head. Yeah, we didn't expect to see that kind of finish. A point guard getting up like that? Boy, that is special. Yep, that one goes in there. 14 points for DeJounte Murray. When you allow good scores to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. That's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. Now here is Harris. It's Harden with the drive. Pass to Thibault. Philadelphia moving the ball around. And Tucker slams it in. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, G.A., right when your teammate makes that kind of play. And that could be the spark they needed to make a little run as they try to even this thing up. Here's Young. Philadelphia getting their last shot to go. Uh, I'm sure his teammates love having a guy like Collins on the receiving end of those alley-oops. As fun an assist as you'll get. Now, here is Harden. And he uses the glass on the way. Harden's got 35 in the game. And, and that's a great piece of work to get to the hoop there. Just tore the D to shreds. And stolen by Feibel. Here's Hunter. That's in, coming off the assist from Young. 
Young's got six assists now in the game. Man, the defense has to recognize this. Hunter is a legit threat to shoot off the catch. And Philadelphia calls time here. Maxi's checked in for Matisse Thibel. And a switch here also for Atlanta. Bogdan Bogdanovich, he's checked in for DeJounte Murray. Harden against Young. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. There's always been a natural power to Harden's game. Contact rarely affects a guard of his size. First team. Here's Young. Unloads from 13. It's good. Young's got seven points here in this quarter. And from this range, Young is automatic. Uh, let him shoot, and he'll knock those down. Harris a screen on Bogdanovich. He kicks to Harden. Takes it inside. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The ultimate weapon offensively. Harden just draws so much attention. Matisse Theibel checked in for the 76ers. He hits both from the strike. 146 left to play here in the fourth. Young from outside. And they'll get another chance. Outside, Bogdanovich. Feeds it to Collins. Outside, Bogdanovich. Five to shoot. And stolen by Feibel. And it's Harden slamming it to oh, That has to hurt if you're the defense. Harden getting fancy with the jam. Pass to Young. Back to Bogdanovich. 11 left here in the fourth quarter. Gonna go that time. It's Harden with the drive and the jam by Harden. One of the best scores in the clutch. Harden doing it again. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. They're leading by six. 105 left in the fourth. Five left in the fourth quarter. Young from outside. No good that time. And the defense dodged one right there. Not the guy you want to leave open. And Harden with the stuff. Few guys can be as trusted as Harden when you're in these situations. He knows how to get it done. And the Hawks with possession here after the Sixers pick up two. And he commits the intentional foul. Bogdanovich passes to Young. That ball. Nice feed that time from Bogdanovich. Relentless in their approach, even with the game firmly in hand. No let up with these guys. They're going for the throw now. Oh, how about using the rim to get some true hang time? You know, he just wanted to make sure the landing was softer than the takeoff. Now, here's Bogdanovich. Young outside. Just five to shoot. Back to Bogdanovich for three. The offensive rebound. Timeout called the 76ers. They're trailing by five. There's 10 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, what do you think? They're trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. Yeah, it has to be fast. They got to take the first good look they get. Money! And who else do you want in this situation? It's all about him being, and he's ready to carry that load. The assist from The Hawks call timeout. And sees your time, everybody. 2 1 
And the 76ers making a change here. Seven seconds left in the fourth quarter, and that's an intentional foul. Yeah, that's right. No other option but to foul and look for some misses. That's his second personal foul. And the first of two, no good. Heartbreaker. And not someone you want to send to the foul line. Here. Bogdanovich, an excellent free throw shooter. And he ends up making the second, and that gives them a four-point cushion. And so here is Philadelphia. The three from Harden. And again, that gives him 51. Making it look easy. And an impressive passer at the five spot. Embiid always has a great feel for when his guys are open. So the first one drops, and that will put them up by two. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a three-point game. The last make was huge. Now, realistically, the worst-case scenario for them is 0-2. And so it's the Hawks who come out on top. They break the hearts of every fan in the building with a dramatic late victory. And, and Kevin, this is the kind of win you have to take a ton of pride in. I mean, they battled with everything they had and came through when the pressure was at its highest. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thank you very much, guys. Trey, what does a win like this mean in terms of where this team is heading? I think we're heading in the right direction. Uh, I'm super excited about the future here in Atlanta, the future in this team, and I mean, we're heading in the right direction. Certainly looks like it, man. Thanks very much. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.